Hey, I'm an idiot. Wasn't recording. This thing came with its original, what I think is original power supply. KR, Main Taiwan, Republic of China. Okay, that's all unraveled. Oh, and in the intro, I did a impression of Shango doing a impression of Retro Chad. Here we have a box. It was better than that. But, you know, I wasn't recording. That was not a jump cut. I pressed pause. So anyway, at least you could see me unwrapping the actual thing. So this is a Montgomery Ward TV radio. And some were made by Shin Shirasuna Electric Corporation, which you know is silver. They made boom boxes. This one might have been made by silver, but there's no FCC ID. But those ones were made in Taiwan, just like this one. Oh, it's not yellowed. Here's the images. It looked yellowed. And there's a guy selling another one of these. It's nice and white, not yellowed. Look how professional that guy was. He even wrapped the handle. Pretty heavy. You might be thinking to yourself, Self, why did he buy another one of these? Well, you know how the other ones were RF only? This one's not. This one's different. It has an AV input. And this thing at the bottom is for batteries. Dying to see who manufactured the CRT. It looks the same as that other one. One of the Emerson, the Massachusetts tube. Might be one of those. Anyway, here's the back. Production date, October 1987. Best Buy, 2014. So, when were those? Oh, here's a date code. Yeah, I was thinking the same thing. 03 or 07. Rayovac Alkaline Maximum. Yeah, I don't know if this tube is shot or what. So... Let's turn it on. Awesome. Uh, it's on the country station. Yeah. They, they play Bon Jovi and Aerosmith way too much in the past month. From the Prime Minister's office, meeting Not very with noisy. Listen to that. Ago. So you take the screws out right there. Top part of the cabinet lifts up. The bit of finagling, I got it open, mostly. Helps if you take the volume knob off. You just got to pry this part off. You can see how dirty it is in there. Yeah, another Matsushita tube. 150 CHB22. Kind of a burning smell in here. Big Tycon capacitor right there. There's a flyback, the focus and screen adjust, which doesn't need to be touched. The focus is razor sharp. Now, is that, is that Mitsumi or Sanyo? You need a schematic to decipher what these are, but they're labeled NEC tuner. Ooh, what's up with that thing right there? It's all back together now. There's a piece of metal right here. Is that in case the plastic breaks, it'll stay on? It's pretty cool. Coming along pretty good. But there's a bunch of dirt in the corners there. Okay, let's turn this off and turn this on. Yeah, look at that. That looks really good in person. Wow. Surprised by how good it looks. Yeah, perfectly watchable image. I know I'm not your mama, but all I have to do tonight. I'm not the fuck you! Wait, 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 Oh, I'm missing that right now, but that's fine. So we're testing this thing out, which is pretty cool. Does this look better on this TV than it does on the JVC I picked up and even the Samsung? Seems like it, which is kind of weird. Actually leaning forward looking at the TV itself, not my phone. And I was looking at the phone when I drove in the grass right there. This is actually my game save, and I do not remember calling it Tater Man. Like, what the hell is that? See, when I had the other one, there was like a, a line down here, two of them. It annoyed the crap out of me. So, that's the end of the video.